What is going on guys, it is your boy JNG back at you with a brand new video and in this one we'll be checking out some Borderlands 3 gameplay. This game just has dropped on Friday, so I am so anticipated to play this game it's for you guys. Awesome. Like, I agree, it's going to be so awesome, but we just have got done watching the Night of Champions pay-per-view. What did you think about it? Uh, that was pretty good for like a B, B rated pay-per-view. It was good. There was a couple good spots, um, the main event was good. Definitely spoiler alerts think? coming. I just want to tell you guys. Yeah, definitely. Sure. Uh, Luke Harper came out, so he returned after being gone for like four or five months or more. Which um, I feel like that was just a, a way for me to get money in his contract, but that's that's just you know my my, my opinion. But, uh, anyways, probably maybe he was just bored. They found something for him to do. Right. Yeah. It took him long enough. But it was nice for him to come back because I've been waiting for so long for him to it come back. Took him long enough to give him something to do. He came out in Eric Rowan's match. And attacked uh, Roman Reigns. Well, she came in there with, like, I didn't even see him coming. Like, I thought it was, like, Rowan, like, knocked him at first. But then I realized he was, like, Harper just fucking big booed his ass. And, and tell him like, about oh. the main event now. Oh, yeah. My favorite sure. part of the match is when you have Seth Rollins coming in and he freaking delivers a pedigree to Braun Strowman. And then he ends it with a curb stomp. And it's over. Like, that's, that's how you beat a beast. And... In my opinion, Rollins is just one of the top wrestlers right now, and I don't see him really slowing down. Plus, I mean, his, his girlfriend's Becky Lynch, so I mean, yeah. he's, he's he's winning. So, so what would you rate it then? You know, overall. So. Um, as a fan, I enjoyed it, so I'm gonna give it a four out of five. It was pretty good. What um, do you think? I'm gonna have to agree with you. It was pretty solid for what it was. There a few things could have been tweaked a little bit. Uh, I think Randy should have got the title. You gotta finish Randy Orton. Yeah, I agree. That must... uh, let us know what you guys think in the comments. What your opinions are if you've seen it. If not, sorry for the spoilers on that. Yeah, because those were like the two dopest like moments of the match, in my opinion. But Let's enough of the wrestling. This, uh, Borderlands here. Exactly. It is time for the main part of the video. Like this game was a surprise to me, honestly. Like before I heard the release date was coming out. I never knew this was a thing because me and my buddies, you know who they are, um, we played Borderlands 2 for months on end and grind our ass off. If they're watching this, shout out to you guys. You guys know who you are. Shout out to you guys. But um, now nah, like we grinded it for so long, and when I heard that this game was coming out, like I I had I had to pre-order it, like, and it, it's just so awesome. Like, and you've got the other ones, right? And I do yeah. have this only for the PS4. I have the Handsome Collection, which has you know. The pre sequel and Borderlands 2 on it. But for the um, 360, I also have the original one, which is like the um, Borderlands 1, and also that is actually what the files are for like our best characters. Yeah, so and, and that's the only one I've played is Borderlands 1. I think it's good. Briefly played 2 a little bit. Uh, that's as far as I got into it, so it's going to be new for me. Well, you have to find it's out. definitely awesome. Like, you're going to love it. Like, because do you enjoy like shooters and like just customizations, just basically doing what you want in a free world? Oh, yeah. Of then, course. Yeah, it's, it's going to be awesome, actually, because, in my opinion... Don't give away any spoilers on this. Oh, man, because, I mean, truthfully, if this game does not win Game of the Year, I'm kind of going to be upset, honestly, because... And, 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 and uh, also, show the guys, it came with a uh, download, right? Actually, yeah, if you pre-ordered, which from some of my friends, when I talked to them, they said when they went to the release at midnight, they got this too, but it comes with a gold skin... If you pre-ordered it or if you went to the release you get a ghost skin and you know you go into your playstation store you get that into their little redeem code thing on there then you see what confused the shit out of me was i did this right and it downloaded yeah. and everything and until this morning because i was looking to see like how you did it because i was like well when i get to the video i want to throw those guns on there for, right, for you right. guys and i seen that you actually have to go into because i was thinking you know it's on the screen for the customizations but I did do a little spoiler alerts for myself because that shit kind of like ruined some shit for me. But oh no, it's a little different. Than I thought it was like, but oh, it's not what you thought it was gonna be. Before. Yeah, that the mechanics look like, so awesome. Honestly, like I'm so I just oh I'm so happy. I just can't wait to play this game. But guys, sir, enough of this chit chat. Let's get into this video. Enjoy. All right, guys. Sorry about that. There was a little intro to this game. It kind of messed up on us. But anyways, right here we're gonna go ahead and pick our characters. No, all these are brand new characters to the game, so I'm very interested to see how they look. You of course have the siren. This guy, apparently the Beastmaster, apparently has some crazy shit. You got Zane and Moose. Is that how you pronounce it? But yeah, let's go ahead and let's go ahead and get our characters created and let's get started.
Vault Hunter, huh? Name's Marcus. You picked a hell of a time to join the Crimson Raiders. <laughs> Good to see someone survive the attack. I'm Lilith, commander of the Crimson Raiders. Those bandits you fought are part of a cult hunting for the vault map. You and I are gonna find it first. For now, my scout is waiting for you up ahead. Good luck. That voice, was that another siren? This is your stop, Vault Hunter. Finally, I'm itching for a vault. Try to stay alive. I'd hate to lose a new customer. <laughs> And welcome to Pandora! Hey, you must be the new recruit. I am a CL4PTP steward bot, but you can just call me General Claptrap of the Crimson Raiders! What's your name? Surely you know who I am. The Tiger of Partali? Crime fighter? Warrior for peace? Ugh, it's Amara. Thanks! I'll pre-order your tombstone just in case. Now, those jerks who tried to murder you are the children of the vault, a bandit cult who followed their creepy leaders with blind devotion. Which reminds me, if you're going to obey my every second call, you'll need an echo device. The Echo 3. Slightly more powerful than the Echo 2, and twice as expensive. Besides, the Echo 2 had a tiny issue with spontaneous combustion, so they regretted those as grenades. Now listen up, recruit. Lilith ordered us to take over a Children of the Vault propaganda center. Time to show those culty weirdos that no one messes with the Crimson Raiders. Follow me, recruit, to glory! Before we wreak our righteous vengeance, you'll need to register your Echo in this quick change. Once we defeat the cult, I'll be famous. And when I'm signing autographs, I need you looking sharp while defending me from my legions of fans slash stalkers. You look awfully attractive. over there. That gate is really mucking up our mission. Mucking, I say! You did it! Best recruit ever! Doki Kaka. Stand around. 
survived this long. Relax! On Pandora, it's actually super weird if something's not exploding. Now take your gun, recruit. You're gonna need it. These guns, like myself, aren't beholden to their primary function. I can dance and sing! And some guns now include an alternate shooting mode. Try it out! Follow me, recruit! Wait here. I'll talk my way in, become their king, and then you'll surprise slaughter them in cold blood. Watch and learn, recruit. Hello? Anyone there? This is Shen. All the influencer of the children of the vault. What do you want, Crambot? Hello, bloodthirsty maniac. It is I, Claptrap, Slayer of the Destroyer, and Super General of the Crimson Raiders. We have you completely surrounded. Open the gates now, and perhaps I will be merciful. Uh, yeah. Let me think about that. They might call themselves Children of the Vault, but they're still bandits, and bandits are incredibly stupid. Okay, we're going to surrender. Please don't kill us, Crapot. That's what I thought. Open the doors immediately for your new king! Easy! Easy! I'm, uh, I'm coming out! Just wait right there! We did it! I did it! Another victory for the Crimson Raiders! Hey, I feel funny. What's happening to me? Claptrap can be a little claptrap, but he's still one of us. You're gonna have to save him. I'll be there soon. Look here. I 
know only the eternal. God, receive me! Shield in that special red chest over there! out in the first round. <laughs> I thought Pandora was going to give me a challenge. Score one for the Crimson Raiders. You and Claptrap secure the area. I'm on my way. Alright guys, so we're just taking a quick look through our items right here, so if you've never played this game, right here it just runs you through a simple tutorial and it shows you exactly how, like, you know, to discard things, to put weapons you want to use, to set, like, your shield and 
things of that nature. But yeah, so far, guys, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. It's been a while since I played Borderlands, so got a little rusty running up those hills. So, but so far, it's been pretty good. What I do you think so far? Uh, love spike there. I know we we destroyed him really quick, actually. Like we just we cut through him like butter. <laughs> that wasn't bad at all. Alright, so if you want to, we just go ahead and just get through this freaking tutorial stuff. Okay. But yeah, guys, this game is actually really dope. I enjoy just the overall aspect and the look of it is really nice. Like, having all, like, the saturation of the graphics looks like it's so beautiful. And just looking at all these colors right here, like, there's so many options. Like, because right here you can see you have to actually beat the game to actually unlock this, apparently. And see, this is where we look at our missions and such things like that. And see, we go over here. This is like the map. And from what I've heard, this is how you teleport to, which is very new to me because on Borderlands 2 and other games, you was, you had a designated station you had to actually actually get to. Like you had to go to that specific station that was either somewhere around the area you were in to actually get somewhere. But guys, this game is really dope, and I just hope you guys have been enjoying this video so far. Stopped hurting people for this. Wow! I did it! I single handedly took on the COV and sent them packing. Now all that's left is to signal Lilith that the mission is complete. <laughs> Cults destroyed every other Crimson Raider stronghold, so this will have to do for now. So what's your name, killer? I am Amara. Nice tattoo, Siren Sister. You must be the voice in my head. Yeah, about that. Not the weirdest thing you're gonna see on Pandora. But seriously, thanks for answering my call. We might not have the numbers, but with a badass like you, we've got a fighting chance. Welcome to the Crimson Raiders. Pandora's a dangerous place. That grenade mod will come in handy. You should equip it before we get started. Let me know when you're ready. It's your funeral. Hey, do you hear bloodthirsty screaming? More COV. Let's see what you got, recruit. There's too many of them! We're doomed! Hey! It's the Firehawk! The God Queen wants her hand! Got a foothold. Maybe things are turning our way. Come on, killer, you're with me. Let me catch you up. A while back we found a map, led to vaults all over the borderlands. Dream come true, right? 
I didn't realize how big of a target it would make us. We got attacked and the map was lost. I've been looking for it ever since. This way. I was so focused on finding the map, I didn't notice that Pandora was changing. The bandit clans used to just murder each other for fun. Now, they're all under one banner. <coughs> oh. Take me on! Ah, the children of the vault. Their leaders are the... Followers worship the gods. They're convinced the map will lead them to something called the Great Vault. And they've been <coughs> slaughtering anyone who... Mm -hmm. Actually, I'm not gonna lie. Actually, that that was pretty cool. Like, it seems like they definitely made the duels pretty cool in this game. That was so dope. We definitely gotta do some more of that later on, actually. Locked. <laughs> not gonna keep a siren out, though. I'm gonna set up camp and gather some intel on the Calypsos. Find the Sun Smasher War Chief and do whatever it takes to get that map. All right, guys. Well, I think right there we're just gonna leave the video. So far, this series has been well. This is not even a series yet. Let me let me rephrase that. Uh, this video has been pretty dope so far. Like, I look forward to making more videos like this. And if you guys did enjoy the video, just give it a thumbs up. Cause I just want to know what you guys think about this. Cause the video game side of this channel is kind of something still new, so it's kind of like a newborn baby. You gotta nurse it to health and see what you guys think about it. But overall, KDM, what's your uh, thoughts on this? Oh, it's a really cool game, man. Um, definitely want to get further into it and see what we can do. Yeah, definitely the guns. I'm looking forward to getting some legendary guns and definitely some freaking shields and class mods. Just making my sirens oh so powerful, like. That was my favorite thing on the old Borderlands. Like, getting that shit to OP2 or like OP7. It was a fun journey. Like, I look forward to redoing this on this game. But, guys, thank you so much for watching. And as always, remember, have a great rest of your day.